The chance to become legends. The greatest stage in Scottish football, the Scottish Cup final. A final that may not have taken place at all has given us the most intriguing of matchups. On one side, St Johnston aiming to become just the second club outside of Celtic and Rangers to win a League Cup and Scottish Cup double in the one season, whose manager in his maiden season in charge of not just this club, his club, but all told, and he could walk away from Hamden having won back-to-back -back cups. He stands on the very brink of joining some of the country's footballing behemoths. Record number of away wins as Kane slices over the bar. It's a chance. It's a really good chance for Chris Kane. But, you know, that was a great chance for, for Boyle to go and just knock it into the, the channel and, and make a race of it. And he slows it down, St Johnson get back in numbers, but they're going to have to do that. They will have to double up in them at times to nullify that threat. But they're far from a one-man team, <laughs> but he oh, just absolutely. carries so much of a threat down that side. Here's Middleton, shrugged off Doig. This is brilliant from Glenn Middleton. And he couldn't squeeze it home. Look at Gogic, look where he is now. Look at the space that he makes up to get that final block in, and it's comfortable in the end for Macy. As Boyle comes forward, it's a lovely hanging ball, and it's over his own crossbar by Jason Kerr. And it's the only place he could have put it. Boyle getting free down that right-hand side. That's the only place that he can put it to make sure Doyle's just there ready to put it in, but what a ball from Martin Boyle. No goals as yet. Second quarter of the final. There's Newell. Oh, it's broken for Irvin. Xander Clark stands firm. Big save. Big save for Xander Clark. I think it's comfortable straight at him, but he still has to make it. And it's Joe Newell that's busting through. And you just wonder if it lands to the left foot of Joe Newell. It's possibly a goal. Saints play on with Craig Bryson out to Booth. Beyond the half hour now at the National Stadium. Here goes Bryson, runs into McGinn. Booth wins it back. There's blood and thunder out there. Here's Wotherspoon. Sold Gogic the dummy in, comes the ball! And there is the goal! The man who won the League Cup for St Johnston lands the first blow of the Scottish Cup final! It is St Johnston legend Sean Rooney! And the Perth side lead the final. Well, who else was going to pop up with a goal but Sean Rooney he loves the cup competitions. And it's a fantastic goal. Booth, two brilliant tackles. Watch a little dummy from David Wotherspoon. And he just puts it into the back post for Rooney to go and attack it. Back across Macy, absolutely no chance. Then the quality comes from David Wotherspoon. Puts it into the back post, just stands it up. It's a mismatch at that back post. And Sean Rooney with a calm finish. There's Newell, a bit of pitch to work in here. He goes himself and it rises over the bar. It's a good effort. The space had opened up for him and it's something that St Johnston, we speak about the, the, the big players for St Johnston, Boyle, Doys, Niz, but, but Joe Newell driving into that space, they can't switch off. I was hoping Booth was high up the pitch. It's away by Boyle. Here's Irvin. Nisbet, across the face, it was a good opportunity, well what comes to Jackson Irvin, Nisbet's in space, takes a good first touch, he's going for that far post, he just doesn't catch it. Hips free kick here, as they look to find an equaliser. Newell's free kick, and it's Doidge. It's a second chance, Irvin, big opportunity there! And there are arms in the air as well. No penalty, and Saints are away on a counter here. With Middleton, who's round again. He's going to fancy this himself here. Really good challenge by Newell, and then Rooney's efforts deflected wide. Oh, what a what a break that is. I can't believe he's missed. He puts his leg up to, to, to put Sean Rooney off, which he does. He gets the touch on it. And it's brilliant from Newell, not giving up.
getting back in to make the first block and then the second one. Oh, now Xander Clark had to put that over his crossbar. It's Irvin's cross. Outswinger from Boyle. Here's Dodge. Scored a couple of goals here this season against Hearts in the semi final of what was essentially last season's competition. This bit and Boiler in the middle, Murphy in the overlap. Breaks for St Johnston, and it's three on three here. Middleton's got Kane to his left. Rooney's held back a bit. It's going to come back to Middleton here. Spilled by Macy, but he's fortunate. He gets a good connection, it's straight at Matt Macy, and he manages to gather it at the second attempt. Here's Wotherspoon, he's in behind Doig. Kane's in the box. Wotherspoon doesn't need him, he goes himself. Doesn't really trouble Macy in the end. Murray Davidson. Oh, that's going to break for Kane. Big chance potentially to win the cup. He goes down. St Johnston penalty. Who's just about to pull the trigger. A little trip of his legs there. It's a correct decision. And it's a huge chance now for St Johnston to go further into the lead. Well, it's Glenn Middleton who had a really disappointing loan spell at Easter Road last season. Scored the winner against Hibs in the league towards the end of the campaign. Is this his time? Is this St Johnston's time again? It is Middleton. Good save, Macy, but Kane's there. It's a double save. Hibs are still in this final. Thanks to Matt Macy. Oh, it's a tremendous double save from Matt Macy. I mentioned his size. You know, looking up in that goal, he fills the goal really well. They are just over 10 minutes from history. But Hibs still have time. Holberg takes it, and the header's held on to. Porteous was up attacking, Xander Clark holds on for dear life. Yeah, it's a good delivery from Halberg. Now Deutsch. He's got the right weight for Murphy. Yes, he does. Murphy's kept it in play. Deep. That time from Jamie Murphy. Oh, now the Hibs players appeal, but it's gone the other way. Yellow for Martin Boyle for diving. His reaction tells you that the referee could be right. Holberg chips it in. One again by Jimmy McCart, and that's it! A superb season has just become an extraordinary season for St Johnston Football Club. It's been the season of their dreams, and Jason Kerr who held the League Cup above his head in that very spot at Hamden after the win over Livingston in the League Cup final. That's for sure. And it is St Johnston's Cup! It is St Johnston's season! They have won the 2021 Scottish Cup! St Johnston League Cup winners 2021. St Johnston Scottish Cup winners 2021. Double winners. History maker.